Hi, my name is Robin Bremer, and I'd like to share with you um, some events. Um, in my book, Feed My People Joy, um, that's available at Amazon, I have a section in there about the supernatural and the things that happen in the Old and the New Testament, Testament are available for you today. And God wants me to share with you the supernatural experiences that I have with Him as I fellowship with Him to encourage you to expect and to experience the same thing. And the thing I want to share with you today is about called the Blue Prayer Cloths. And at my church, I go to the Lighthouse Christian Center, um, which has a website called lighthouseok.org, uh, because I'm in Oklahoma. And uh, it is now... Uh, uh, videotaping live that you can get on the internet and watch it so you might see some of this stuff happen to me while uh, you're watching the internet because I cover people with the blue uh, with the blue uh, cover cloths but this is a story that happened uh, over a year ago I was uh, on Thursday we have prayer and I always felt I wanted to cover up when I was praying because it's a very um, private thing so I would one day I went I was just really wanted to do this so finally I got up the nerve I went and got one of the prayer, blue prayer cloths that we cover up people when when they get slain in the spirit and you know you cover their legs or the chest or anything hanging out or sticking out and they get very anointed because that anointing is transferable and it gets in those blue cloths and uh, I decided I just wanted to cover my head because I wanted to pray in private so I went and got the blue prayer uh, prayer cloth um, and, and covered my head and prayed and, and would pray but let me back up a little bit. I forgot to tell you something. Um, one day while I was in prayer on Thursday at church, I was praying and I was thinking of covering with these cloths. And in my spirit, I had my eyes closed. I saw a, a figure walk over to me and cover me with the blue cloth or a blue mantle. Uh, a blue, put it on, he put something blue on my shoulders. And so I said, well, you know, I'm going to start covering up with those blue prayer cloths. So I did. And then not soon afterwards, we were having a revival at our church. And somebody yelled, hey, Robin. And I turned around. You know, and I had been up front there praying in the spirit. When I'm covering people, I take my job very seriously. I'm highly honored to be an um, altar worker. And that's a person who um, covers with the cloth. And we walk aside of the minister and give him his water or his towels and we just kind of watch him and read his body language and pray in the Holy Spirit, see what that uh, uh, minister needs or evangelist needs and then get it for him. And we pray, I pray and intercede the whole time in tongues and I believe the other people do too. While I'm covering up the people, I'm catching the people, which I hate to do because <laughs> it hurts sometimes, I cover up the people and I also pray with them because I'm an ordained minister so I also sometimes pray with them and that's a whole nother story but I was covering up people and then sometimes we run out of covers so when the people get up I get the covers back well one of the uh, catchers yelled my name and I tried to look at him and they had one of these blue prayer cloths somebody had just given him and he whipped it at me as a ball well I turned around to catch it I went like this and as I turned around to catch it he threw it into my stomach and it was so anointed, it picked me up and threw me about four feet back. I think they have it on the camera somewhere, but I, I have I don't know where. They said that somebody said they did. And it picked me up and it threw me like four feet back on the floor. And people, the person that threw it to me and some of the uh, other catchers saw it. And ever since that time, <laughs> whenever I'm working the altar and I'm drunk, and when they tease me, sometimes they will deliberately call my name and turn around and they will whip these at me, the blue prayer cloths. And not all the time, but a lot of the times when the, the blue clear prayer cloths hit me, I instantly like that am drunk in the spirit or I fall over or I freeze or I shake. But you can, you can physically see the manifested presence on my flesh of of the glory of the anointing and it's really a lot of fun because you know they just they just whip them at me to, and get me so stuck on the floor and so drunk and and uh, I just have a good time but that's one of the the story of the blue prayer cloths that's in my book feed my people joy and a lot of the other stories and I just want to share that with you so and I hope it encourages you to believe God for the supernatural in your life and my name is Robin Bremer and I'm out for today